Hi, I'm going to talk about VoIP trunk creation in Nano PB X version 2. Once you log in with the credentials, go to trunks menu, click view IP trunks, and then click new SIP trunk, type the protocol as SIP, and select the context naming. Here we have three different context naming. One is based on username, the second is based on provider name, and the final one is assigned by Astex GUI. Based on username is nothing but the the VoIP trunk has been authenticated via the username and password. Based on provider name will be authenticated via the IP address configured in Nano PBX. Assigned by Astex GUI is nothing but creating a peer-to-peer -peer configuration. So once select the desired one, you can you can have the provider name here. Host name by default for host name is by default you can give the host name uh, as per the ISP host port by default it is 5060 if it is different please configure the same username as given by the service provider password again as given by the service provider click save So once you created, you can see the account which is listed out here, sip.broadvoice.com, and Kodak details everything. You can configure it by click by editing this sip trunk. Here, you can set the Kodak preferences, whichever the Kodak you need. Set the caller ID, outbound proxy, enable message waiting indication if it is required, and then click save. Finally, click apply changes. Thank you for watching this session.